Let us pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And in this is not the temptation, but deliver us from evil. Heal Mary. For the glory is the glory is to you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Be praised and thanked at all times. The most blessed and divine sacrament. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, give thy life for sweetness and our hope. To you we cry for banishing of you. To you we send our sights, mourning and weeping in society of tears. Turn the most gracious advocate, from the rise of mercy towards us. And after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of your own Jesus, O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Mary, help of Christians, pray for us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among men, and blessed is the fruit of your own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Be praised and thanked at all times. The most blessed and divine sacrament. Hail, Holy Queen. Mother of mercy, may our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you we cry for banished children of Eve. To you who descend on our sights, morning and evening in this valley of tears. Turn the most gracious advocate, the rise of mercy towards us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of your own Jesus, O clement and O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Mary, all of Christians, pray for us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Be praised and thanked at all times. The most blessed and divine sacrament. Heal, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, heal our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you we cry and bash children. To you send our sights, morning and evening in this body of tears. Turn the most gracious advocate, who rise of mercy towards us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of your own Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Mary, help of Christians, pray for us. Remember, most holy Virgin Mary, 
that this has never been heard, that someone sought your protection, begged your patronage, and asked for your help, and was abandoned. With this confidence, I turn to you, Mother, Virgin of the Virgins. I come to you, tears in my eyes, guilty of so many sins. I bow down to your feet and ask for mercy. Do not despise my supplication, O Mother of the world, but listen to me with kindness and hear me. Amen. Prayer for deliverance from the coronavirus. Almighty and eternal God, from whom the whole universe receives energy, existence, and life, we come to you to invoke your mercy, because today we are still living the fragility of the human condition in the experience of a new viral epidemic. We believe that it is you who guides the course of human history and that your love, whatever our human condition may be, this is why we trust the sick and their families to you. For the pastoral mystery of your Son gives salvation and relief to their body and their spirit. Help each member of society do their job by strengthening the spirit of mutual solidarity. Support doctors and health workers, educators and social workers, in the performance of their duties. You who are comfort in fatigue and support in weakness through the intercession of the Blessed Virgin Mary and of all the holy doctors and healers, keep all evil away from us. Free us from the epidemic that is affecting us so that we can calmly resume our usual occupations and praise you and thank you with a heart in you. We trust you and address our plea to you for Christ our Lord. Amen. Remember that we all heard the same words from our parents and elders. Magshir ka, wag kang madamo. Isipin mo ang iyong kapatid. Share to your classmates. Isipin mo ang mga batang hindi nakakakain katulad mo o hindi nakakapag-aral. All these words did not just want us to be generous. All these words were teaching us that we are not alone. I am sure you have heard Tom Hanks and his wife. They are positive of the COVID-19 virus. And when we hear of Tom Hanks, we remember his movie, Cast Away. Yung nag-iisa siyang nabuhay sa isang isla ng apat na taon. Walang kasamang tao. Ang naging kausap lang niya ay isang volleyball na pinangalanan niyang Wilson. Isang volleyball na kasama niya sa hirap at ginhawa sa loob ng apat na taon. That movie tells us one simple but important fact of life. That we cannot be alone. That we are not alone. We are not just our own selves. We cannot just think of our own selves. We cannot just be thinking of our own families and our own communities. There will always be others with us. There will always be others around us. Whatever we say, whatever we do, they all affect someone in a good or bad way. And what is sadder is when we do something and affect others badly. If ever this new coronavirus was indeed manufactured by somebody 
with both scientific and malicious intent, that person's actions now affect millions of people worldwide in a very bad way. Lots of people are sick. Lots of families are affected. Lots of schools and businesses are closed. So many millions affected in a very bad way. If it is true that that scientist is now affecting millions of people in a bad way, then as sons and daughters of Don Bosco, as people beloved and protected by Mary, help of Christians, as sons and daughters of the same true God, we can do something to affect others in a good way. St. John Bosco calls us to be good companions. And we can be good companions when we give good examples. Let us be good examples at home. Let us do our ordinary things extraordinarily well, be it work, study, hobby, house chores, just washing the plates, housekeeping, prayer with the family, and of course, observing our quarantine rules. We pray it will only be one month, and it can be possible if we are good examples in obeying the present rules and policies in our society today, at this moment. People who give good examples are not mere devils. They are seguristas. They obey. If you want this COVID-19 virus to just fade away, we do not give it a chance to spread around. And that starts with us. And so, dear friends, in a time when we cannot donate nor receive Relief goods. Wag lang sarili ang isipin. We are children of God. We obey. We give good example. God bless and good night. Good night, Father God.